with the production of Captain America 4, aka Captain America New World Order, set to be in full swing by the time we get to the summer, Anthony Mackie is slowly making the rounds, hyping up the next couple of projects he's in. And when asked if he could explain why Captain America is going to be different in the fourth film compared to everything that Steve Rogers, played by Chris Evans, did, he gets a little bit more into it, talking about exactly what sets him apart. So Mackie said that the one thing they want to explore, just like they did in The Falcon and the Winter Soldier, is the human side of Sam Wilson and how he is a completely different person and character than Steve Rogers and how in different situations he reacts because he can't rely on Super Soldier Serum, he can't rely on the Avengers, and many times he can't even rely on his own skills because guess what? He's not super powered and he's going up against people way stronger, faster, and bigger than him. And he said that if you look at the comics, that's one thing that Falcon explored. So it's going to be interesting to look into this side of it. And he says now that he's Captain America, the real story is what's next? Because everybody in the world is going to have doubt. Now he's not talking about the real world, which that's already a thing. He's talking about the Marvel world in the context of this, saying that obviously people are going to look at him and go, how does he do this? He's not a super soldier. We've seen him get beat. We've literally seen him in all these positions where the other guy who was Captain America literally was beating him senseless. So how does he answer the call and what does he bring to the table? And one thing that Anthony Mackie said that really, I think, resonated with me was the portrayal of a human being in this position and overcoming these odds. Now, again, he's kind of pulling into that whole real world feel, you know? David versus Goliath type of scenario where if you look at the bigger guy facing off against a smaller guy, you always think, well, clearly the guy who's going to bench 800 pounds and set some sort of world record is obviously going to beat the guy who can barely bench press 405. But guess what? The guy that can bench press 405 is a little faster, can outthink him, can outmaneuver him, and he's not relying on just his pure strength. So I think it's interesting that he's pulling that angle and I think we're going to see him honestly utilize not just his brains, but also the gadgets in his suit and the shield to perfection, kind of uh, showing us things that Cap never did. And if we really look back at Captain America so far in the MCU, Steve did certain things. Unfortunately, a lot of those were in the first film and montages, like tossing the shield and how he uses it and how he can be very offensive with it and we've seen sam already utilize that in the falcon and the winter soldier so it sounds like they're going to push more of that angle how does his suit and his skill augment him not being super powered and having to use his brains and his tactical advantage <laughs> 